In embedded systems, a board support package is an implementation of specific support code for a given board that conforms to a given operating system. It is commonly built with a bootloader that contains the minimal device support to load the operating system and device drivers for all the devices on the board. Some suppliers also provide a root file system, a tool chain for building programs to run on the embedded system, and utilities to configure the device. History This term has been in use since 1981 when Hunter and Ready, the developers of VRTX, first used the term to describe the hardware dependent software needed to run VRTX on a specific hardware platform. The phrase is commonly associated with Wind River Systems for its VXWorks embedded operating system because of its extensive device driver offerings, but since the 1980s it has been in wide use throughout the industry. For example, QNX Software Systems also distributes BSPs, as does Microsoft, NVIDIA and many others. In fact, Virtually all ATOS providers will use the term BSP to describe the hardware support software modules available for their ATOS. Example, the Wind River Board Support Package for the ARM Integrator 920T board contains, among other things, the following elements, a config H file, which defines constants such as ROM size and RAM high ADRS, a make file, which defines binary versions of VXWorks ROM images for programming into flash memory. A bootram file, which defines the bootline parameters for the board. A target ref file, which describes board specific information such as switch and jumper settings, interrupt levels, and offset bias. A VXWorks image. Various C files, including flashmemcia Euro, the device driver for the board's flash memory. PCI IOMAP show CA Euro mapping file for the PCI bus, Prime Sol SIO CA Euro TTY driver, Syslib CA Euro system dependent routine specific to this board, Ruminit SA Euro RAM initialization module for the board. Contains entry code for images that start running from ROM. Additionally, the BSP is supposed to perform the following operations initialize the processor, initialize the bus, initialize the interrupt controller. Initialize the clock, initialize the RAM settings, configure the segments, load and run bootloader from flash.